But you just said finding kids and family. Walk me through how you build your national team roster. Are you sitting back, Pat, and and waiting for the emails to come in and then you kind of see which ones you like? Or are you being on the offensive, looking for players? Walk me through how you curate this roster, which, you know, needs to have kids that's going to buy into the school as well and buy into your culture and your system. Because I've asked this before of other coaches, like the coach at Finley Prep, Oak Hill, and I'm real curious to hear your answer. Yeah, I think we're fortunate enough because we've been doing it long enough where people, um, they know us, they know our coaching staff, they know our school, um, and they know kids that, you know, we're targeting and kids that fit well and had succeeded here. Um, so whether it be um, college coaches, um, travel ball coaches, AAU programs, um, reaching out and saying, hey, they have a kid that's looking to, you know, possibly go to a, a boarding school situation for their junior or senior year, reaching out to us. And then, you know, we do our homework. Um, and some of it is families just reaching out via email and trying to learn more about the school. But I would say 90% of the time, um, it's someone in the basketball world, at least for our team, uh, reaching out to us um, that we have a relationship with saying, hey, there's a kid or family interested in exploring your school. Um, would you like to, you know, get the conversation going? So, um, and then in the spring and summer, our coaching staff, we're out and about uh, at all these AAU events and camps, um, watching and evaluating kids, right? So, uh, you know, from the basketball piece, seeing how skilled they are, but, you know, when we're watching the games, we're also seeing how they interact with their teammates, how they interact on the bench when things aren't going well. Um, after the game, are they cleaning up the bench? How do they interact with media? Um, and then also, Crazy enough, how do their fan, like how do their parents, um, you know, carry themselves and conduct themselves in the stands? Uh, it's just little things like that. That's stuff that we we pride ourselves on, um, and just try to do a, as best homework as we possibly can.